this guy's doing really well. I look forward to him going into the 125 gallon with everybody else. I will put him in on a weekend to make sure there's no aggression between anyone else and him because with newcomers in the tank, your current fish, especially the yellow tangs or the coal tangs, they can get a little territorial and they can go after the newcomers. All right. One other tip with that, if your yellow tang is aggressive, take his ass out of the tank Put him someplace for a day, maybe the quarantine tank, and then when you put him back in, he'll be seen as, or he'll think he's the last comer to the tank, alright? So being the last one in the tank, he won't be as aggressive. You can also move some rocks around to trick him so he thinks it's a new territory. They're smart, but they're not that smart when it comes to that. If he thinks it's a new territory, he won't be as aggressive because he won't see it as his home. All right. Thanks for watching. I appreciate all the subscribers and all the comments. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Like the channel, give it a thumbs up. That way we can rank higher in the Google rankings and YouTube and we can be seen by more reefers and we'll spread our knowledge to more. Thanks guys. Thank you so much. See you next weekend. mix up your jugs sounds kind of weird but anyway you don't want to mix up your jugs meaning let's say that you take this jug and you empty the you siphon the bad water from the tank into this one jug right then you use that jug for your fresh water for next week's oil change that's oil change yeah you know what you don't want to put oil in your water I don't know where I got the car fish tank thing mixed up no oil change Wow Water change. Never use oil in your fish tank. They don't appreciate that. That's only for car engines. Let's start that again.